Hello there and welcome once again to Red Gaming Tech for yet more gaming news with myself, Amata, as of the 29th of June. In this particular video, I'm bringing you some news concerning The Division, which of course was revealed by Ubisoft at E3, and it looks pretty damn impressive, but they have admitted that they left with many questions unanswered as to how the game will actually work. While senior community developer Antoine Emmond has moved to clarify the game's always online co-op and PvP mechanics in a recent community Q&A. So if you're wondering how this game is actually going to work, well, he seems to have answered quite a few of your questions, and I've got some direct quotes from him here. The Division is an online open-world RPG experience where exploration, objectives, and player progression are all essential. You can team up with a group of friends in co-op and jump in and out at any time. In certain areas, you can also seamlessly engage in PvP and experience suspenseful scenarios where danger can come from anywhere and anyone. And when he was speaking more specifically on player versus player scenarios, Emmons explained, player versus player combat will play a very big role in our game. The choices you make as a division agent can either spur recovery or plunge the city into further chaos. The people you meet in certain areas of the game can either be your best friends or your worst enemies. So you constantly be making decisions that will impact the world around you. And he did also promise an extensive character customization uh, system as well as collectibles that will offer every player and every character a sense of uniqueness. And he had this to say. The Division is an RPG, so we really want the player to feel unique. There will be tons of possibilities to customize your agent, thousands of weapon types, skill combinations, gear and much more. So, so quite a bit of information revealed on The Division. It sounds pretty damn cool if I do say so myself. And it seems like the always online is actually built into the core of the game, which is absolutely fine. Obviously, they're going for a more of an MMO kind of feel where, you know, you can join up with people, do PvP and stuff like that, or you can just play it as a lone wolf if you wish. But it sounds like it's definitely designed with the co-op and the PvP, basically having actual loads of players running around and all of that in mind, which is absolutely fine. I think the Division was probably one of the biggest surprises of E3. And I was just looking at some of the responses to this particular game, and a lot of people seem to be very excited by it indeed. And I have to say, I am as well. Ubisoft are one of my favourite development houses. They always seem to come up with new and interesting ideas for pretty much most things that they do. I mean, the Assassin's Creed series, of course, one of my favourite gaming series of all time. Of course, it's kind of gone downhill a little bit with Assassin's Creed 3, but it's still a fantastic series. And they've done many, many good games, including Rayman that they did recently and many others that... Just, it would be too long to list every single awesome game that Ubisoft had made. I probably could do a video just on that. Um, but still, I'm very much looking forward to the, the Division. Excuse me. And from what he's describing, it sounds pretty damn cool. I love the idea of the storyline behind the world. The look of the world looks really cool. The intensive um, character customization, the possibility for PvP, co-op as well. It sounds like they've really got an interesting idea in mind. And while preventing the collapse of society is not exactly a new idea by any stretch of the imagination. I think that's probably one of the most overdone ideas in any form of media. It sounds like they are bringing a fresh perspective on it with some new ideas and presenting it in an interesting manner, which is absolutely fine. This game it looks very, very cool indeed. I'm happy to get some information on it. Anyway, that's me done for this video. Hit me up with any thoughts and opinions down below. Are you looking forward to The Division? What would you like to see gameplay-wise, character customization-wise? And just generally, what would you like to see in this particular game? Is it on high up on your list? Was it one of the big, ooh, games for you at E3? Be curious to know. Anyway, that's me done for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.